of workflow. This is a TTS. One sentence voice learning of workflow. It can imitate the timbre and speaking style of the sentence in one go. You can listen to it. The effect of this learning. Just clean the sound. Then I gave him a voice for reference. What colors I to wear? Guess it's black. If I change it to something else, for example, Lei Jun. Come on, beautiful lady. What color lady. are you wearing today? Good to generate. This is what you need to generate according to what he said. That's it. One quick learning effect. You can increase this number of steps according to the situation. It won't be the default. This clone is pretty fast. The following is the sentence segmentation. The default is OK. You can listen to his effect here. Hello, beautiful lady. Come sit on my lap. Don't be shy. I'm a decent person. I guess you're wearing black today. Is it right? I guessed. He can clone Lei Chang's voice in one go. If you don't believe, you can do it again. Now this is Jay Shu's voice. Let him run. Quite fast, actually. I will introduce others later. This is the voice type. Other workflow features. I will introduce them one by one. Hello, beautiful lady. Come sit on my lap. Don't be shy. I'm a decent person. I guess you're wearing black today. Is it right? I guessed. So young. The clone is perfect. Because he only needs one word. So the amount of his this training. effect has been achieved. Anyway, it can be used. Good next. Next, let me introduce this. Workflow of Vincent first and sound editing. Let me give you a brief introduction. The first one is to use the prompt word to generate audio. Up to 11 seconds. Here you can set the time within 10 seconds. An audio. The effect is perfect. I will introduce it in detail later. I'm using the online mirror of Duana Cloud. People don't want to deploy locally. They want to use. Just click on my mirror. I'm using an online mirror. Update to the latest version. You can see all my lasers. This workflow is ready to use. No need to deploy or anything like because that. Because I have already deployed it. You can see now what I can use. You can also use. If you don't want to use it online, if you want to deploy locally, you can open my notes. The Confuit tutorial will jump to this workflow location. Click on voice. Here is my first voice clone. All node downloads and workflow downloads. Etc. There are digital ones too. Basic installation method, model download. There are also workflow downloads. People who deploy locally can just look at my notes. But I think it is more convenient to use online mirrors directly. Okay, the first workflow, mainly audio generation. And replace modification. A workflow for editing. You can simply understand. Vincent audio bar. For example, this is to generate a background sound of a dog barking. 
Then the setting here is 10 seconds, because it can only last 10 seconds at most. Here is the reverse prompt, where it's basically the same as your folder. Then just click generate. You opened everything below. Wait for it to generate. Let me introduce the following. The note below is edited. It can mainly edit the audio accurately. For example, I want to add or remove some sounds from this audio. You can edit and modify through this node. For example, here is to add a sound of a train passing by. He will add this audio. The final output. After the above is generated, the sound Let's is listen the tone blocking. That's the perfect sound. Generate any sound using a prompt or within Yilin seconds. Okay, the first one passed. That one is called Vincent Audio. Listen to this. This is what I said. Plus the sound of the train. You can set the parameters yourself. Or fine tune the number of steps or something. You can understand this by translating it yourself. Then click Generate. He will add the background sound of the train passing by in my audio. This is suitable for editing. Increase or Remove an audio editing node. The one below is not the same as the one above. You can understand the following as replacement. OK, listen to it after the above is generator. So I added the sound of a train. Mix in this audio. So this is mainly used for editing audio. OK. This one. The one below is the audio of a sentence given to him. Then it says dog barking. He will follow this rhythm. We also need to realize this dog barking, dog barking so it is understood as voice change or sound replacement. Generate. Adhering to the original sound. Beautiful lady, what color are you wearing today? This is the voice of a conversation. Then I wrote the background sound of the dog barking. He will output a laser. This reference speech rate or sound wave graph. Generates the sound of a dog barking. Simply understood as voice change. We'll just refer to it some ways. This way you can better control the rhythm of the audio. So these three nodes are very practical. OK, let me introduce the next one. Next is the song. A clone of a supporting song. I voice changer. This is also very practical. The nodes are different. That's it. Below is the sound you want to clone. This node is just to separate the voice from the background music. This way the sound will be pure. The one above is also. Here is a song. I want to replace the lead singer's voice in this song with Lei Chang's voice. He also separated the voice through this. This is the sound of human voice. This is background music. OK, let's generate it. The node in the middle is used to clone the sound. Then the one above is the reference sound. Finally, it's done. Transform this whole song into one song by Lei Zheng. 
Listen to the results. This is the voice of a girl singing. Then use it to separate the vocals and background music. This is just background music. The above is a pure human voice. Okay, let's combine this voice into this. The first to separate Lei Chang's vocals. Combined with the second, then the two exchange. Clone yes. Then use this note to combine the accompaniment. It becomes Lei Jin Xinjiang. So this note has the function of sound cloning. Okay, you can change the voice of the song yourself. The second one is actually the same as above. Below me is Lei Jun. Zhe Zhou is above. I want to turn his word into his voice. Become the voice below. For example, let's listen to what he said. Hello, beautiful lady. What color are you wearing today? I guess it's black. Just this sentence. I replaced it with Lei Chang's voice. Just run, yes, because it's not a song. No need to separate it from a background music. What was just described was that the video memory was because it needs larger video memory exploded. Similar to this problem, just refresh or reload. Normally, refresh. The benefit of my image is that you can see what I can use. When you open my image, it can also be used. Don't worry about reporting errors or anything like that. Because what like I'm that. showing you now is yes. online mirror. Then you will use the same one as me. Refresh this GPU and it will be reset to zero. So you can run this node function directly. The video memory is full. Just refresh. Then you can run it again. The effect of this voice changed. If you listen to him now, he will sound like the clone of Lei Jun below. Say what the audio above says. Hello, beautiful lady. What color are you wearing today? I guess it's black. Okay, listen to the original Hello, version Hello, beautiful again. lady. What color are you wearing today? You wear black. So this is sound cloning. In fact, it is the same as the TTS voice clone of the previous Xiao Hongshu. Can't feel the difference. They are all very good. Okay, this one is over. Let me introduce the next one. This is a pretty cool one, a node ever 5 for voice separation. There are various ways to separate. Here I will simply show his vocal separation. Other models, you can refer to. Anyway, this is the best separation effect at present. UVR Wu. Of course, other nodes also have this. It's just that his name isn't. But the model is the same. These settings are by default. Because he is already very good at this technology. 
This is just a small workflow. That's it. When you use it, you can put this. Because this is a configure. So you can switch back and forth between these. Don't worry, you don't have to deploy this model or anything because it's already deployed. So, all the tools here can be mixed and combined. Don't be afraid of making mistakes. No models, etc. Deployment issues. This is also one of the reasons why all workflows should be deployed in a configure. It is more practical. Infinite combinations possible. A feature you need. This separates the vocal. The above is the human voice. This is background music. Just memorize the background music, but I want to separate the other. You can test the other models yourself. When you click on other models, it will automatically download. So you don't have to think about downloading the model. When you run it, it automatically downloads. Okay, that's all for this issue. Let's go play.